time when the oceans drank Atlantis and the rise of the sons of Arius, there was an age undreamed of. And on to this, Conan, destined to bear the jeweled crown of Aquilonia upon a troubled brow. It is I, his chronicler, who alone can tell thee of his saga. Let me tell you of the days of high adventure. Fire and wind come from the sky, from the gods of the sky. But Krom is your god, Krom, and he lives in the earth. Once giants lived in the earth, Conan, and the darkness of chaos, they fooled Krom, and they took from him the enigma of steel. Krom was angered and they shocked, and fire and wind struck down these giants and they threw bodies into the waters. But in the rage, they got the secret of steel that laid it in the battlefields. We found it. And no men, no gods, no giants, just men. The secret of the steel has always carried with the mystery. You must learn its discipline. No one in this world you can trust. No men, no women, no beasts. This you can trust. Fire and wind come from the sky, from the gods of the sky. But Krum is your god. Krum, and he lives in the earth. Once giants lived in the earth, Conan. And in the darkness of chaos, they fooled Krum. And they took from him the enigma of steel. Krum was angered, and the earth shook. And fire and wind struck down these giants, and they threw their bodies into the waters. But in their rage, the gods forgot the secret of steel and left it on the battlefield. And we who found it are just men. Not gods, not giants. Just men. The secret of steel has always carried with it a mystery. You must learn its riddle, Conan. You must learn its discipline. For no one, no one in this world can you trust. Not men, not women, not beasts. This you can trust. El origen de la lengua inglesa estuvo en la fuerza afilada de la espada y de luchas sangrientas. Normandos, bretaños y celtas imponían su lengua extranjera sobre territorios conquistados. Ardía el fuego bajo el punto de la congelación como hoy ocurre en Crimea. Ayer como hoy, a través de la lengua materna aprendemos valores para toda la vida. proceso de convertirse en persona. If you want to achieve greatness, stop asking for permission. If opportunity doesn't knock, build a door. Cowards never start, the weak never finish, winners never quit. 
everything you want is on the other side of fear. Two things define you, your passions when you have nothing and your attitude when you have everything. If you try to be something you are not, you'll end up being nothing. The future is always beginning now. The difference between who you are and who you want to be is what you do. When for a cause, no for applause. Life live to express, not to impress. Don't try to make your friends not just make, just, just make your ass and fail. Remember that your greatest talent is so much more powerful than your biggest fear. Peace begins with a smile. Success is the ability to go from one failure to another with no loss of enthusiasm. Winston Churchill. The more you love your decisions, the less you need others to love them. Some people create their own storms, then get upset when it rains. Only in the darkness can you see the stars. The Old Man and the Sea by Ernest Hemingway Actividad, ver, oír, comprender. Ambiente y escena. Tiempo y lugar de un acto de habla. Secuencia de hechos. La clave establece el tono, la manera o espíritu del acto del habla. Wake up. We're gonna have supper. I'm not very hungry. Come on, eat. You can't fish and not eat. I have. You'll not fish without eating while I'm alive. <laughs> then live a long time and take care of yourself. Santiago, huh? I could go with you again. We've made some money. No, no. You're on a lucky boat now. I know you did not leave because you doubted me. It's been 84 days since I caught a fish. Stay with him. It was Papa who made me leave. I am a boy. And I must obey him. I know. But it's quite normal. 
When I was your age, I was before the mast on a square-rigged ship that ran to Africa. I have seen lions on the beaches in the evening. <laughs> yeah, I know. You told me. Tomorrow is going to be a good day with this current. Where are you going to go? Far out, so as to come in when the wind shifts. Santiago, how old was I when you first took me in a boat? Five. And you nearly were killed when I brought the fish in too green. And he nearly tore the boat to pieces. Can you remember? I remember everything from when we first went together. The old man knew he was going far out, and he left the smell of the line behind and rode out into the clean early morning the smell of the ocean. Good luck, Manolet. Good luck, old man. In the dark, the old man could feel the morning coming. As he rode, he heard the trembling sound as flying fish left the water, and the hissing of their stiff set wings made as they soared away in the darkness. a beautiful bait. There might be a big fish around this school. It has to be swimming nearby. this chance. This far out, he must be huge in this month. Eat it. Come on, fish, eat it. He will take it. God help him to take it. Come up easy. And let me put the harpoon into you. Are you ready? No! His line was strong and made for heavy fish, and he held it against his back until it was so taut that beads of water were jumping from it. Danny began to make a slow hissing sound in the water, and he still held it bracing himself against the truck and leaning back against the pool. The boat began to move slowly up toward the northwest. The fish moved steadily and they traveled slowly on the calm water. The other baits were still in the water, but there was nothing to be done. I wish I had the boy, the old man said aloud. I'm being towed by the fish, I'm towing bait. I could make the line fast, but then he could break it. I must hold him all I can and give him line when he must have it. Thank God he's traveling and not going down.
The fish never changed his course nor his direction all the night. As far as the man could tell from watching the stars, it was cold after the sun went down, and the old man's sweat dried the cold on his back, and his arm, and his old legs. He was very fond of flying fish as they were his principal friends on the ocean. The old man knew he was going far out and he left the smell of the land behind and rowed out into the clean early morning smell of the ocean. I hope he doesn't know there is only one man against him. An old man. I must convince him of my strength. I convinced everybody else that time in the tavern in Casablanca when I played the hand game with that great black who was the strongest man on the docks. We had gone one day and one night facing one another. Our forearms were straight up and our hands gripped tight. We were trying to force each other's hand down on the table. There was much better. And people went in and out of the room under the kerosene lamps. Eleven hours and still counting. They changed the referees every four hours so that the referees could sleep. Many of the betters had asked for a draw because they had to go to work on the docks loading sacks of sugar. Otherwise, everyone would have wanted it to go to a finish. Sunday morning and ended on a Monday morning. For a long time after that, everyone had called me the champion. Man is not much beside the great birds and beasts. Though they are not as intelligent as we who kill them, they are more noble and more able. I would rather be that beast down there in the darkness of the sea. The fish is my brother, but I must kill him. Glad we do not have to kill the stars. Imagine if each day a man must try to kill the moon. The moon rises.
runs away. But imagine if a man each day should have to try to kill the sun. We are born lucky. It is enough to live on the sea and kill our true brothers. I have never seen or heard of such a fish. And now we are joined together. I don't know what that fish was that looked to bait just now. It could have been a marlin, or a broadbill, or a shark. I never felt him. I had to get rid of him too fast. badly as mine does, but he cannot pull this skiff forever, no matter how great he is. Now everything is cleared away that might make trouble, and I have a big reserve of life, all that a man can ask. enough line to handle him. Maybe if I can increase the tension just a little, it will hurt him and he will jump. Now that it is daylight, let him jump, so that he'll fill the sacks along, his backbone with air, and then he cannot go deep to die. Yes, <laughs> 
grande, caballo. No lo puedo creer. Es el más grande que nunca he Don't sit up. Drink this. They beat me, Manolin. He didn't beat you. Not the fish. No, truly. It was afterwards. Did they search for me? Of course. How much did you suffer? Plenty. You know, I missed you. Now we fish together again. I am not lucky anymore. The hell with luck. I'll bring the luck with me. Get well fast. For there's much that I can learn and you can teach me everything. I will bring you something to eat. Rest well, old man. taller donde será traducido al inglés con la ayuda del profesor quien explicará las partes de la oración conteste por favor las siguientes preguntas a qué edad salió el niño a pescar when he was five and he was nearly killed by a fish who nearly tore the boat to pieces Reconocimiento visual de signo lingüístico. Imitar, copiar, reproducir, actuar. Reconocimiento auditivo del signo lingüístico. Escribir, comunicar, comprender, interpretar. La aprendemos de niño, un periodo cuando la lengua es la reina y el oído es el rey. La fonética inglesa debe ser oída, luego imitada, copiada, reproducida, actuada, tal como hacemos con el aprendizaje de nuestra lengua materna.